What's up you guys, it's me Deja Marie and in today's video I'll be showing you how I personally make my doormats. Um, if you are interested in this video, please continue to watch. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn up the notification bell on so you are notified every time I post. Y'all, I'm almost at 100 subscribers. I'm so thankful for each and every one of you. And I just cannot wait to keep growing with you guys. Yay! But yeah, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe for me. And I'm going to just get right into the video. Okay, so this is the mat that I was asked to make. So I was just showing you guys. So now I'm gonna just go ahead and go to my Cricut app. I'll pick the fonts that I'll use and I'm just gonna start the design. So now I'm all done with the design, so I'm going to put it on custom and click premium vinyl and I am using freezer paper. Also, when you're done with the design, make sure that you're turning the mirror on so when you lift up the paper, it's cut out the proper way. Okay, so now it is all done. So now you just see me picking out the letters from the cutout. You can go ahead and throw those away because you will not need them. So as you can see, I did not take out like the letter O, E, A because you'll need those when you're making the mat. So don't throw those away that has like that excess letter so you know what letter it is.
so in order to keep the poster in place i like to just put these pins down so that it won't move and i also pin down the excess cutout for the letters So now I'm just taking in the excess cutout so I could put it in the letters to make sure that I don't mess it up when I'm painting it. So now I'm just starting to paint. I got this paint from Walmart and I got the little paint paint with the pack of 25 colors from Amazon. So if you are interested in doing this, you can get them either from Amazon or from Walmart. I am painting majority of the colors uh, of the letters black, but she did want the ISH part in pink. So that's what I'll be doing.
So after I feel like I got enough paint down, I always like to go back in and fill in the letters. I try not to put too much paint down initially because I don't want to over, you know, do the paint. So it's easier to fill it in rather than trying to fix it afterwards. So that's what I'll be doing now. And then it has to dry for about an hour. So my phone actually cut off when I was putting the little dot, but that's what I did. Then I set it outside to dry. And now I'm just going ahead and putting the sealant on it. I use Fex Clear. I also got this from Walmart. I like to spray it in a little cup and put it on myself because sometimes it does come off like white. So I like to just put it on there. So this is the doormat, this is the finishing touch, I added my clear flex seal so that it can stay in place and then I'm gonna just, it takes a little minute, I think, I think it's like 24 hours to dry so I'm gonna sit it outside and yep, yeah, that was the end of this video, I hope it wasn't too long but yeah y'all don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Oh.